Hey. You should have done yourself favor and died while you had chance, Kroshka. Great. <clears throat> Where are you going? If you can move, leave. Trouble never comes alone. Right. Roger that, Rasputin. I'll get right the fuck out. But I didn't. I couldn't. Where was I gonna go? So we came to an understanding. He would put up with me just as long as I pulled my own weight. And that was my shitty start to six long months. It's been about eight weeks now since I lost track of Claire. The old man pulled my battered ass out of the wreckage and patched me up. As for the bracelet, mine never changed color. And I never turned into one of those things. Lucky me, right? As soon as I was back on two legs, the old guy told me I had to help with hunting. Basically, it was on me to kill my own food. House rules. Can you use gun? Uh, more or less? Good. You collect on bullets. You run out, not my problem. Look, I get it. I won't be a burden. You finished. You go to sawmill entrance deep in forest. The big gate. I remember. It's very important you get there by sundown. Otherwise, monsters will have Kroshka for dinner. Yum, yum, yum. Well, thanks for scaring my appetite away. I help you, now you help me. Get this beautiful after it's repaid. Yeah, yeah, let's get this hunt on the road before you die of old age. Fuck! I hate using guns! Stop whining! Keep working! You need what out of this. All right, Barry. I know I have to eat, but... Poor thing. You will get to this.
eat those insects if you remember to cook fruit. I think that's a really great idea. I'm not going to try. The ghosts are for the food you like. Snake, rat, hair. Maybe you find a wild hamburger. Let me just pull up my good girl petticoat so it doesn't get dirty. When you are done, head for gate. Yes, sir.
We've got what we need. Can we call it a day? Okay. This should be enough food. Thank God. I can't wait to lie down. Lie down? We finish early. You helped me cut up me. Wow! Educational. I thought that was it. I couldn't take another second of getting muscled around by some man who thought he knew better than me. Why don't we find a way off the island, I asked. Yes, he said. No point. You need face reality. His house, his rules. But I wasn't about to give up hope. Not yet. All I kept thinking was... All I kept thinking about was my dad, actually. That night, I had a dream Barry was on his deathbed. He looked really sad. Nobody was with him. <laughs> Nobody to nag. He had no fire left. When I woke up, I realized I'd been crying. <laughs> 